Hey guys, what's up? It's Frexus, and welcome back to our Let's Play Elysium Remastered series, Part 9, where we play as a pure mage, where we can only use spells, staffs, scrolls, and robes, and we're back. Um, last time we went into this Duskalow crevice, and I'm glad to be out of there, honestly. Um, it was quite a trip trying to get in and out of there. We're on the hunt for these relics of the Crusader. Um, so we actually need, I believe, one, two, three, four, four more. So the armor boots, mace, and shield. So let's take a look here. Um, pull up the map. All right. I'm trying to see what would be the closest. Du -du 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 -du. Well, there's boots. And there's one up there, too, for the armor. I tell you what, let's go and find the armor, and then we'll double back to Broken Helm Hollow and go get the boots. Sounds like a plan. Wow, absolutely beautiful. I tell you, every time that I come back to Elysium, you know, because I do Aldenari as well, and sometimes I play other models, but every time that I come back to Elysium, it's just like incredible the visuals are absolutely incredible um i'll see you guys when we get a little bit closer oh boy we can work this out peacefully yeah oh who, who would ever thought that the rabbit would be what ends up saving me if you will did we win poor little thing we're getting closer. That's it, just right up there. Oh, little rabbit. What is this? Just a random thing, huh? The wolves probably got him too. Looks like it was a hunter. Let's see, should this be down here? If it's to be believed with what the map is telling me here. That is another good thing about Octato's recital, is every time when I do get in combat, any spells are cast that have been assigned. Alright. Tolvald's Cave. Something tells me, I just have a sneaking suspicion, that there's going to be Falmer in here, and this is going to be a ride. You know what? I just got to thinking... Before we go in a dark cave, I, I remember that the last time the hardest thing was not having candlelight. So I'm going to see if I can go to the college before we do this and see if we can get any spells, just kind of some quality of life or anything to help us along. Okay, guys, long time for me, not really long for you. So basically what I did, I went and I got quite a few new spells. Mostly this quality of life spells. I did purchase some illusion magic but I probably won't use a majority of them like the fury and fear and all that um, notably fury just because it has a, ch a chance to fail above targets above level six and I don't have any spec and illusion yet but I did get stone flesh so I went ahead and redid Okato's recital so with all that being said though I think we are well on our way. I'm actually going to cast a muscle here. Because something else... I really probably should be sneaking on some of this. Oh, oh, oh. Ooh. Hold on. Hold on. For I am... <laughs> That's epic. Still doesn't matter. Okay. When the locks are too hard, just make them easier. Am I right? Ooh, carded draconians. I'm curious on how that deck is actually coming. It's like glowing all different colors. I knew I should have sneak, snuck. There is a light source, though. And who knows? Eventually, I could be a super sneaky mage. 
I'm sure that will help to my survivability too. Hello? And before I forget, I had Frost Rune at one point, and now I have Fire Rune. I'm gonna set that to eight. I'm gonna set this. Yeah. Just in case. I just see this massive thing, Lucian. Fall back, my friend. And the good thing about these runes is they will level up my destruction quite a bit quicker. Like that's a good way to level up in the beginning. Really any spell can level you up, but... Ooh, coin purse. And Apothecary's Satchel. Alright, so so far just bears, nothing I really can't handle. Um, I still... I, I still don't trust it. And I just went hidden from something, apparently. Are you sure we're oh. going the right way? Nope. Did you guys see? Ah! I thought that killed him. And I was like, holy crap, that was powerful. Did not. Can confirm. Did not kill him. Come here, you stupid. Where'd it go? Where did it go? Gosh, this is nerve wracking. <laughs> All right, might as well turn on my light because we can't see anyways, right? Where did this thing go? It needs to die. How did that light? There we go. All right. Well, that could have been really bad. <laughs> Alright, let's go ahead and see if we can dwimmer. Okay. Something tells me that I'm being watched. What's in the chest? Actually, first off. Is there like a trap or anything? Is it salvage dwarven armor, card of fortune? I'm curious on the card of fortune, but I knew it! I knew it! Also knew it. Also freaking knew it. Oh! Side, they shoot arrows at me. Here, summon another thing. So two. That's what's so tricky about Fallen, man, is they can just one shot you just about with the poison. There's one in here, too. There you go. Go in there. Perfect. Perfect. Yes, yes, yes. Go, go, go. Get him? No, he's still alive. He, she? Beautiful. Well, I, 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 oh. Oh no, this isn't good. This is not good. I don't like this. I feel like I'm surrounded. There's one over there. Do you, do you not see it? Do you not see it? Super powerful rune. Yes. Got this. There's something else up there. Oh my gosh. This is so nerve wracking, guys. You see that poison. A lot of times, like, they'll get you and you don't even know what's going on. Oh my gosh. Go, 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 go. Fall back. Oh, 
Oh yes, you're doing great. Oh, there you go. Here's some health. Not for the Falmer, for you! Oh goodness, okay. Here. Go further out. Explore the world. Alright, Lucian. You alright? Yeah, I see him. He's in there. Oh! It's a wizard. Got him, got him, got him, got him, got him. I hear him. I hear him, guys. Oh my gosh. This is so nerve-wracking. I don't even care right now. That has a staff. Then there, Lucian. Look out, Lucian. I think that is tied to a quest. Perfect. Yes! Alright. That's where we came from. I can't really use anything that they have, even the poisons. Mm. Let's drop a... whoops. Drop a save. Perfect. Kind of explore, see what they got. Again, not much that I can really use. Disgusting creatures. Oh, I'm just kidding! Okay, girls, get on out there. Greet our new friend. The way that we greet people. You see him? You do. Die. Die. Stagger. Please stagger. Golly, I'll master these guys. No joke. I mean, I'm like dual casting fireballs. Now, if I had fireballs, I think that would be quite a different story. But, uh, I don't. <laughs> but it's going to be so worth it at the end, guys, when we, like, deck Lucian out. Not only will he look cool, but he should be quite a bit tougher. No! I'm like so... I just know. I know how it can be. I know that literally you can see a Falmer or something like that and then you're just dead. Like instantly. Especially on Master Difficulty. That's why I'm kind of letting my, my peeps kind of take care of the grunt things because I know how this Falmer do. Experience too much. We're making good progress though. Honestly, what it is. Oh, no. Alright, well. I really would rather not use my fireball staff. Even though I do have some uh, soul chips, I am running low. Oh my goodness. Frick. Run. Get out of there. Stronger after dawns. Okay. Still another one over here, yeah? Oh! Oh! Go from the ceiling? Are you serious? That's the thing. I mean, the AI truly doesn't have like a stealth mechanic, but Fulmer are going to be the closest thing to it. I mean, literally just dropping out of ceilings, hiding behind things with poisons. <laughs> <laughs> gets ridiculous. Alright. What's in here? Anything? Ooh, Ruby! Alright. Oh gosh. Something tells me it's going to get even more. Vomer infested. Shoo! My goodness. Turn the light off. I see one. 
there. Yeah. I don't think it's just one though. Okay. Here. Yeah. No. It does not affect one. Ow. Ow. That hurt. Ow. What is going on? Like, see? Oh, whoa, God. See, that's what I'm talking about right there, guys. Literally right there. Um. 60 points, vigorous healing, regeneration. No! Ah, still wasn't enough. See, that's what I'm talking about, guys. You guys saw how quickly I just died. The wards. Hold on. The wards in this. I'm wondering if the wards deflect arrows at some point, or is that just a perk? Let's see, let's go to restoration. Lesser ward. Spell damage, yeah. But I'm pretty sure in the Restoration Tree, it gives me the option. Some kind of option for wards, right? Vigilant Ward. Reduce incoming damage, that's good. Let's see. That's just all spells. Hmm. Maybe I'm thinking of a different perk tree. Still, negating damage, that would be helpful. Okay, um, summon, you know what, actually, I think a Frost Atronaut would do wonders here. If I can survive while summoning now high, 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 Oh, gosh. Is there one literally right here? Oh my gosh, there is, and I can't do anything about it. One down, only like seven or eight to go. Okay. Lucy, I need you up, bro. I need you up, and I need you out there, other boss. Oh! Oh my gosh, this is nerve wracking. So nerve wracking. I don't have anything really up front, up close. Don't just get one shot. At least they're coming to us. That's good. At least I don't think it is. That's not good. 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 Go. Go. Okay. How do you deal with two of them? Huh? Rexus Master Conjurer. Yep. Get out of here, man. Get out of here. Perfect tanks. I need to charge magic. Go on down there. I mean, I guess you can stay there if you want. You know what? Let's get extra in the fun there. Lucian, you guys are doing great right now. Just let me help things with fireballs. Okay, I think... I think we're safe. I think. Okay. You know, I've seen it floating around through other channels and stuff, and I really have considered doing this, and I'm thinking about doing it. Let me know what you guys think. Uh, I'm thinking of doing a quest playthrough with a completionist mod, like, uh, where it basically shows you what all quests you completed, what all quests there are, and how to basically activate them, like the prerequisites for starting them. And I'm genuinely, whoops, genuinely curious 
you guys would be interested in the best that I can do of a 100% Skyrim. Like, doing everything. But I'm trying to think of the type of character that I'd want to do it. Because I also have another character build that I have in mind that would be very uh, unique, I guess. It's like, not your typical run of the mill. Not the easiest build. But let me know what you'll uh, think of that. If you would be interested in seeing something on that. Oh my gosh. It's just like they're not there and then everyone is there. It's like getting woke up literally with someone that's like. They're like snipers. That's literally what they're like. Like Call of Duty snipers. Not even the quick scope ones. Just snipers in general. Lucid, I do not want to be in this scenario here. Did I just kill Lucian? No, I did not. Lucian. <laughs> Lucian! Oh my gosh. Alright. You guys go and deal with that archer up there. Lucian, I'm sorry, are you okay? Yeah. Everyone knows. There we go. Take your eye off me, that's your worst mistake. And it led to your death. Good stuff. Good stuff. We are progressing slowly but surely in this, and that is how you need to progress through these caves. You can't just run gung-ho with all the traps and such. I mean, as we saw earlier, it's not even super obvious a lot of the times. Where am I going now? Hello? Hello? Okay, so this wasn't even an area, like, to go anywhere. It must be this way. Frick. At least I can see him. If I can see him before they fire the arrow, I'm good. Wasn't this the exact reason of why I left this last, like, dungeon? It's because I was going against higher level people that were just, like, one shot me? <laughs> Alright. Uh. Okay, that's one down. But I know there's another one. Because that's what killed me last time. Where is it? Man, I feel like I'm seeing things that aren't even there, honestly. <laughs> you see this my trigger finger there? Okay. Let's actually do this. Something sees me. Perfect. Alright. That wasn't... Okay. Just go. Go. Go for it. It's right there. Kill it. Okay. Cleared. Right, yeah. Let's go. the one bad thing about tight spaces and having as many Atronach summons as I do. Just get stuck. Behind you. Behind you. Okay. Do one just for fun. Just in case. Alright. Guys, move. There's times where I wish that you would explore on your own, but I know that you don't do it. So. 
check that. That's actually a good selling price. I, I don't like this. I don't. Sure no. Up there. Up top. Okay, so to the left, and then it looks like that we have some charges potentially to the next in there. I just wanted to hit you. I'm sorry to get this. I want out of here. Oh my gosh. There it is. Ow, ow, ow. Lucia? No, 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 I, I am hating these little narrow thing where I, I don't even have any room. <laughs> Alright, go out there, make me proud. Lucian, go out there, make me proud. Take care of that guy up to the left. That's what I want you to focus on. on these things. I'm going to open it and I'm going to run away. Why did I get so close? I don't know why the two of the most, like, most annoying enemy types in the entire base game are just put together. They were just made for each other. Yeah, well, yeah, when in doubt, summon these big boys. Okay. It's literally right there, but I know that if I go there, I'm just going to die. Kill him. Gosh, you're so creepy. guys are so frustrating. I swear. Go. Yes. Go. Move. Thank you. Alright. There's still one more. That's what my red dot meter says. I'm stuck. You know what? Y'all wait over here. Alright. I think that we're okay. I really do. Armor of the Crusader. Provides bonuses to health and restoration as well as grants resistance to all damage. Beautiful! Let's get out of this godforsaken. My goodness. I never want to see another farmer again. Oh my gosh. Let's wait until they. What's next? <laughs> Golly, man. There is no telling. You know, I was thinking and hoping that we would have enough time to get all four, but I really don't think we're going to. That cave took quite a bit longer than what I was thinking it was going to take. Any other time, Draugr, bring him on. But Falmer, my goodness, man. This almost...
almost like this area over here almost looks like Day Spring Canyon. I mean, just like the aesthetics. Like, it's like fall, autumn time. Oh gosh, what is this? What's your, what's your deal? Seriously. Who are you? I guess that's relevant. Your horse didn't want anything to do with it. Who are you? Ooh. We need to pray. That's what we need to do. I don't know what um, Hermaeus Mora gives, but we need to pray. Prayer? Yeah, pray. 20. So it's pretty low. I wonder if it's like a spell or something. I think this is Day Spring Canyon, guys. I almost, like, I'd be willing to just say I know. This looks so familiar. You guys don't really look. You know what? Here. Yep, I knew it. Ooh, another Elvic page. Hmm. That's good. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is Day Spring Canyon. I mean, we'll find out in about a minute or so. But, uh, let's see, large knapsack. Let's sell the potions. And I'm, and I'm pretty sure you just, for closure, you can't open this. So now someone in the comment section will be like, why didn't you open the door? They were guarding something. <laughs> Your day spring canyon. And a level up. I'm going to take that level up, actually. I'm going to actually invest in health, because I'm way too squishy. And as for what I want to use, that's the question. I could do Rune Master. You can place runes three times as far away, and they're 10% more powerful. Yeah, let's, let's do that, because I foresee myself using runes quite regularly. It's not going to have me, like, join Dawnguard, is it? I mean, I can do Dawnguard, but I wasn't planning on doing it this early. Oh, hey there. You here to join the Dawnguard, too? No, not Truth is, I'm particularly. I speak with the leader of Dawnguard, which is located in Fort Dawnguard, which is southeast of Frankton. Uh, yeah, I mean, I, I I don't have anything against Dongard, but just, I was not really planning on starting it just quite yet. I want to complete the College of Winterhold quest lines and some of the uh, side guilds before, and more, even more so, uh, Legacy of the Dragonborn before I start the rest of this. Lucian, this is going to be so worth it, dude. I'm telling you. You're going to look so cool. <laughs> And I think this will help you overall in your combat, too. Why can't I go forward? Okay. Is it gonna have me, like, actually do the Dawnguard? Is, is it, like, in Castle Dawnguard? Or Fort Dawnguard, I guess I should say. Alright, here's something. It sounds like a skeever. It's just a skeever. <laughs> I like that. That's going to be the closest thing to a fireball that I get. Ow. Okay. Boots of the Crusader. Let's see. Oh. Oh. Goodness. Let's get out of this cave. Okay, well getting the boots, that was a lot easier than one I had suspected it would have been. So we actually have time, possibly, to get the other two. Um, let's see, one would be the mace. And the other is the shield of the Crusader. Let's see if we can get the shield. Well, definitely a change of scenery, huh? <laughs> I'm wondering if this is guarded like the previous one. If it's like a cave that I actually need to explore. Is that a bear? Oh, 
Please, please. Okay, man, that was... <laughs> that was almost really close. There's something else over here. It's friggin'. Tell you, there's some of these places I genuinely kind of do want to explore, but if I did, this video would be two hours long. <laughs> if I went and discovered literally every location. But who knows? We'll probably get sent back there. And really, the driving force behind it all is just the fact of Legacy of the Dragonborn. There's so many hand placed things with more loot. It's like you, you never know. And a lot of the times, it's not as obvious as what you'd think it would be. Okay. Moment of truth. Is this going to be something where I can just dip in and dip out and grab? Or am I going to have to actually delve into something? Oh, it's Nightingale Inn? I believe that's the inn this is. That's the only, like, building. Yeah. That's kind of odd. But on the same hand, it's really not, because... It's just random chests. Well, let me know if you want anything. Just disregard the Daedra behind me. Uh, um, yeah, but, I mean, it would be different if stuff was just out and about to be looted and such, but since it's in enchanted chests that no one else can open, which I'm so ready to be able to like go back to Den Stagmer's Ring and get some resistances. It's one bad thing. I mean, I could swap it in and out, but what fun is that? Let's see. Shield of the Crusader. Blocking creates a ward that protects against spells for up to 100 points. Time blocks can reflect incoming spells. That's legit. Like, I don't know what Spellbreaker has in this, uh, Modest of Elysium. Because I'm sure it's probably edited with Reliquary of Myth or whatever artifact of the hall is being used. Alright, look out. You you look wonderful. You look wonderful. You look really red and fiery. Okay, we just got, like, what? One more? I think? Because two of those were actually really easy. Um, let me see. Just one last one. And I don't even think that we turn it in to Auron. We just get it done. Oh, that was on my monitor. <laughs> I was like, I thought I saw it. Can I just do this? Can I cheat a little bit and press M? No, of course not. Where is that last thing? Everyone literally yelling at their screen. We do have one. There it is, right there in the mace. And I believe that is the last one. Mace. Yeah, that's it. That is it. So probably quickest would be to... Or, well, safest... <laughs> Let's go here. On to the next. And I believe the last. As long as it's not a cave, we're good. <laughs> I'm like, I'm burnt out on caves right now. I know I've said this in past videos, but it rings true. <laughs> Experience is everything in Elysium. And the way that you get experience is not only by defeating enemies and clearing dungeons and doing quests, but literally just discovering locations. So anytime you see these little diamonds like you'd see in ESO, discover them. Discover them. And actually there's a chest over here, I believe. I'll never forget. Never forget it. I was doing a playtest, because I was going to do a horror mod list playthrough, and I just never got around the tweaking it and finishing it but that destroyed house it was evening time and I I think I was using like uh, uh, Yasgrenil like uh, the uh, not the voice overhaul but the uh, like the music and sound overhaul like very Vikingish. I won't engage here just cause yeah I'll come back and clear it some other time unless they engage first but I also had Mahal's, like, uh, Ma. I thought that that was something other than an elk, and I was about to freak out. Um, I had Mahal's creatures installed, 
and uh, on the original Elysium playthrough that I had, I actually installed them, and it made it even more difficult than it was. Um, I haven't decided. With this one, I'm really just kind of leaving it untouched for the most part. Um, and I, I really don't like adding mods, a lot of mods, like mid-playthrough. It's just not good. If it was at the beginning of the playthrough, that's one thing. But um, but anyways, back to that house. It was in the evening, it was sunset, and it was just eerie. And I go over there, and if you guys are familiar with The Witcher 3, there is a enemy called the Rotting Maiden. And it basically is a... Uh, oh, it's a ritual site. I can't put my hands out. Ah! I saw my life flash before my eyes. Right, right. It was much too short. Well, anyway, Rotting Maiden basically is a dead woman that comes to life. It's not often that you see the actual conjurer that is dead. Ooh, a spell too. Lightning Grasp. Fork Lightning that does 17 points of shock damage. Okay, I don't see what the difference... Ooh, and a Bound Battle Axe. And I'm pretty sure Luminal Bridges is a... Yeah, a Conjuration. I will get along with this story. Anyways... The specter, if you will, pops up, like, when you get close, and lets out a scream. Oh, I saw a treasure map. Uh, the... Oh! It's the, um... I know, I know what that is. That's that thing with the standing stones and the chest. Anyway, it's over there, actually. Goodness, I'm just kind of, like, exploring right now. But anyway, I got close. I didn't know that that was like a set location for that. And I saw a dead person. I went to loot their body. Sprung up out of the ground. Screamed in my face. It was like the evening. It was nighttime when I was playing it. Literally scared the crap out of me. It was ridiculous. Um, Alright. I'm guessing... Oh no. Not this crap. I'm all for a version. You guys know that. But... Alright. Let's see if we can solve this real quick. Um... Yeah, but anyway, so that scared the crap out of me. Of course, I was not recording at the time, so I couldn't, uh, I couldn't get it how I wanted it. What that gum? How do you solve this? Oh, there we go. Uh, dolphin? Whale? That gum? There we go again. And, let's see, this doesn't have a thing, unless it's, like, eagle, alright. That's already an eagle. And this one, I believe I already did. Snake, yes. Alright, that should be it. Otherwise, I'm going to just, like, die horribly, right? So, let's see. That did not work. <sighs> Whatever. What's this? On to the destination. <laughs> oh, crap. Just a random person. Just a random person. What did that Imperial have against me? Makes me think that you're unique because you're just going down to one knee. I need you to uh, not be dead. Are you just gonna crawl to your destination? Well, there you go. And a boy. I'm what you'd call a soldier of fortune. Make me an offer, and I just might fight at your side. Um, you really haven't made a good first impression <laughs> for yourself. Watch your back, friend. Yeah, I'm sure you do. You know what, though? Do it for you. you know what? I that need you. Looks... Yep. That's a fair price. My blade is yours. Because I will take advantage of Nether's follower framework. 
Don't think I won't. Let's get going. Yes, let's get going. I can't tell who looks more rough, you or Lucian. Maybe I should give him the armor. I mean, he's like a warrior. Alright. Oh, a fort. Okay. Let's go around and we'll see whereabouts what fort this is. Oh, crap. Crap baskets in here. Oh, don't worry about it. That did not. I was hoping. An actual thing. Oh, that's beautiful. Another page there. I wonder on those pages if there's like a certain amount that you have to get. Like, if, it, if it's like one and done, once you get a certain type of page, because they've all said something different. And if you look at these pages, they are very strange looking, cryptic. So I have three, and they're all different. I don't have any duplicates yet. Okay, we've arrived at this fort. And just Is like that, there? we're already in the So we got Forest Dog, Lucian, and my Flame After Force. Archers. You're not as bad as you know. <laughs> it literally just fell down. Alright, we're close. We are so close. I feel like since I promised Lucian that we would get him the uh, uh, you know, I think it's a time to find this. Oh dude. Stop. Let me be. Fireballs. Ow, damn it, you stupid. My gosh, this is why I don't use the fireball. That's a prior horse horn. Alright. I cannot aim. Line up the dot, let go. It's not that hard. Lucian. What about a... Uh... Oh, I literally thought that was my hired sword. <laughs> I'm like, seriously. Uh... Where is my hired sword? Oh, there you are. We're stuck. Another... No, I think that is a duplicate. I did not mean to take that. Okay. I come with violence and ill intent, so I suggest that you make whatever you right with your life that you pray to. It's, uh, I may be horrible with fireballs, but uh, not so much. That's something I have to... You know what? Actually, I've been wanting to try this out. Rift Bolt. That did not be what I thought it would do. I'll try it again, but it's not really very promising. No one left alive. Oh, wow. It does kind of transfer them back there. journey is almost over. This is a long... <laughs> kill it. Whatever. If you can kill him by the time that I get to this door, we'll call it. It's not looking like you are. Oh no, you don't. Now that's how it's done. What's... How's what done? Okay. I just want the thing. Oh, it's right here! 
It was just difficulty getting to it. So it deals fire damage and turns the dead and grants a 10 point bonus to one handed weapons when equipped. That's not half bad. Well, that's it. We did it! We completed it. All right. Lastly. Good to see you. I need. Donations are always appreciated. To talk to you. Oh, you have. Want the stuff back. Sort of the crusader. Mm, we can discuss that later. Um. Let's see. So, armor the crusader. Boots the crusader. Helm of the crusader. Shield of the Crusader. I think that's it. And I'm going to keep the ring, but I'm going to go ahead and equip Dead Stack Mystery. I again. think these spider eggs might be about to hatch. What happened to your voice, dude? <laughs> Guys, I'm going to call it there. It's been a long episode thus far. If you've stayed tuned this Check long, I appreciate it. Uh, don't forget, like, comment, else. subscribe, and be sure to hit that notification bell so you, you are notified of all things coming up content-wise, from streams, announcements, etc. Um, with that being said, I appreciate each and every one of you. Uh, thank you again so much. Thank you for 500 subscribers. That is insane. I meant to mention it at the beginning of the video. I did not. I do apologize. As always, I appreciate you. This is Praxis, signing out.